Ashley here from ShaneyToChic.com. Does the thought of using a circular saw make you nervous? Well, this is the video for you. We are breaking down circular saw basics today and our goal is to remove that intimidation and get you working on that DIY to-do list. Ryobi carries 18 volt one plus circular saws and several corded versions too. The blade sizes range from a five and a half inch to seven and a quarter inches. They are all powerful, so pick the saw that best fits your needs. You can use this saw to cut all types of wood, and there are so many awesome features that will allow you to make a variety of cuts. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is secure your workpiece with clamps and then adjust the blade depth. To do this, loosen the depth block knob. You can raise and lower the saw along the scale to set the correct depth. Make sure the blade teeth are no more than a quarter inch below your board. Now just tighten the knob securely. To make a cut, just insert the battery if you're using the 18 volt saw. If you're using a corded saw, plug it in and make sure to keep the cord to your side or back, but never on your work area. Now just place the saw on your work surface and align your blade to your cut line. Make sure that before you start the saw, your blade is not touching the wood. Push the lock off button and press the trigger to start the saw. When the blade is turning at full speed, begin to make your cut. You can clamp a straight board to your workpiece as a guide for making rip cuts. You can also make bevel cuts, which will open the door to so many more project possibilities. Be sure that you always remove the battery or unplug the cord before making any type of adjustment to your saw. Loosen the bevel lock knob and set the base to the angle you want to cut. Then tighten the knob and make your cut. 